Hi, it's Matt. Welcome back to the shop. Um, uh, today, this is just a mess around. <laughs> um, I got one of these. Uh, so this is a, well, I think it's going to be a piece of shit. But we'll find out, right? And probably make a better one in the future. More on that in the future. So basically, basically oh God, what this is, is this is a uh, finger sander. Yeah, a finger file, sandy jobby, for one of these. For your angle grinder, we'll use the cordless one because why not? Um, but actually, this thing's sticking out of here. Fuck me. We'll find out how well this goes. Um, yeah. Where the bloody hell? I had the spanner out. Literally yesterday. The fuck have I done with it? As usual, rapidly running out of room. Where do I put my spanner, spanner? Me spanner! Um, in here at the moment, I've only got really what I need to do videos. That's what I'm trying to, to do. But as usual, I run out of room really rapidly. Um, but this is all only temporary, and more of that soon. What the fuck have I done with it? <laughs> oh come on <clears throat> there we go like a man with a pair of flyers <laughs> like a bodge <laughs> any road so take that shit off that's stuck in there um, said grinder and then it has this fucking thing Jesus There we go. So that is the drive, and then you've got this collar where your, is that it? Oh yeah. Then you've got this collar with a Jubilee clip on it. <laughs> Fucking hell. Oh, this is gonna be fun. At least you never know, right? You never ever know. I, well, I've got a good idea, but we'll see. They actually might fit this pretty well. Um, so yeah, you, you just plonk it on there, tighten it on, good and tight. <laughs> That'll do. It might actually work this, you know. Is it best to have it that way? Do you want know to take the handle off? If you don't know, a lot of these grinders they have positions, but they also have that position. Which, if you're cutting things, I never see anyone do it actually. Uh, I don't think every single grinder on earth has them, but most of them have. What's my other one have? Ah, that's the problem. You see, this one, my other one, my corded one, that doesn't have a hole in the top. That's fucking dumb. You put it there, you fucking dickheads. <laughs> Again, another Ryobi jobby. About the same. What's this say? Does it actually say when? It's when they were both made by the same company, they're both the uh, Tektronic Industries, Germany, made in China. Where was this one made? Angle Grinder, Germany, blah 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 blah. Let's say it's made though. Probably exactly the fucking same. It's when they changed this, this horrible colour. Regardless, that is a good thing, you see. Oh yeah, your trigger's a bit dodgy, but once you get it going, it's not a bad thing to have. Any road. Yes, not all grinders have that position. So you've got to take the, as far as I get this, take the guard off. There's no, I don't think there's, there's your tension. There you go, you've got two positions so you can put your belt on. I'll take your belt off. Fuck yeah, why is this so gay? Why you put a wing nut on there? I want the softest of soft belts. Fucking hell. <laughs> this, this looks so dangerous. <laughs> Fucking Nora. Right then. And then we can adjust that there's a, an eccentric cam, I imagine. So, how do you put more tension on it? Oh, 
God. Do I really need that cover on there? Because that looks like it's just going to fucking annoy me. Let's just put the cover on for safety's sake. Now the reason why I'm using this and not the other grinder is be the cordless one is because the cordless one goes a lot slower. <laughs> it's it's not as fast. What does this say? Seven thousand five hundred RPM for the cordless. And this one's yeah twelve thousand. So if anything, if I'm going to lose anything, this. Electric, the cordless one isn't going to fire it as far away, right? So if I do lose a digit, you also come. It also comes with different arms, which I thought was quite funky. Bigger radius one on the end, or literally an angled finger, um, just in case you need to get in anywhere. And the this fucking graphite impregnated shit is what rubs on the back of the belt. The best thing is, is I don't have to plug anything in. I can just go for it. Oh, right. Here at DB Repair, <laughs> we do cam journals. As you can see, Is it actually blending? Is it just polishing it? <laughs> that is actually doing a good job. I shit you not. Right. <laughs> Who'd have fucking believed it? That is actually doing a good job. I'll get a picture just to give it a bit more. Wow. Now I've got shit all over my bloody camera. Let me get a good picture. That is actually doing a good job. Fucking wow. Like, like actually wow. Let me actually show you, fuck it. Uh, that is actually doing A nice job. The camera isn't its macro, isn't its thing. It's probably good enough there. There, there we go. There we go, it's actually doing a half decent job. That's actually quite amazing. Very quickly as well. Well that's just fucking great! So there you have it, who would have actually thought? Now, this is, you know, this is, the weld isn't, but the rest of it's hard as fuck. So this is a WLT Away Light Tools. It fits my grinder. And I'm not doing any real serious material removal here, you know, I'm just touching up, and this is the shittiest belt. It feels like a, maybe a 240. I've got some more belts here, some better belts, but nothing that goes down that fine. But I think this is fine enough. I think that is cleaned up nicely. That right, I've just been fucking dicking around. Right, that has just cleaned that up. Something wicked. Now, obviously, here at DB, here at DB Repair, we will take your knackered journals that look like this. 
get rid of all the schmutt actually. See, we will take your knacker journals that look like this and we will turn them into this. Look at that! They're fucking beautiful. And you're probably able to do that with a bit of sanding paper, you know, and a bit of memory on your own to polish it up, I mean. But I want to clean up the weld. All become clear why um, later on. It's nothing. It's nothing important at all. It's just a fuck around. But um, yeah, I just want to get in there and knock the heads off them welds and add a bit more if I need to. But it's not imperative, obviously. <laughs> obviously. <laughs> Any road. God, you can see the porosity in that weld, fuck me. But that's a ten times better than it was. So, there's no moral of this story, it's just a very quick video of fucking around and stuff while I'm doing other bits and pieces. This actually this thing, if it did work, has got another slight use, but we'll get into that later. So this thing, yeah, it does what I want it to do. It was 17 quid or something, I can't remember. Nothing really that much. But uh, it's going to do something that I want it to do, which is get in there and just touch them up a bit. Hope that makes sense. <laughs> if it could ever. And I'll see. Right, I've just got to add a bit in because um, I didn't know this since I tried it. So my um, Ryobi grinder here, the collar there is. How big is that? About, it's over 50 millimetres in diameter, so this where the safety guard shit thing goes there. And some of these screws are in the way. This clamp down collar fits on this one. Now it says on the Jubilee clip 33 to 57, that's bollocks. I tried to get um, it on there before and it was on that one, it just has none of it. So this collar is uh let me look 45 so this is 45 millimeters is the cordless one it's straight shank there's no tape to it and the screws are well clear of where it sits on there it sits on here fine on this so that's 45 on this that's 50 something what is it 52 this is 52 and it doesn't want to sit on here no that is that hits these screws and they're all fucking not equidistant so it's a knobhead you want it to go right up to the shoulder there it's too wide it's splaying out too much the jubilee clip will go over it it's just that this is splayed like this and it's kind of tapering and wanting to push the whole thing off not very good so just to add that in there measure your if you if you want to fuck around with one of these you know you can always just go and get yourself a proper one but for the money and what i want to do with it is this it's not a bad thing at all Hope that makes sense. I'll see you in a bit.